The Lusaka Magistrate Court has subpoenaed Tropical Diseases Research Center Director Gershom Chongwe in order for him to present NDC leader Chishimba Kambuili's COVID-19 results. Principal Resident Magistrate David Simusamba has issued the summons in a matter where Kambuili is charged with four counts of forgery, altering a forged document, as well as giving a false document to a public officer. Magistrate Simusamba summoned Dr. Chongwe today after hearing from Cobalt Provincial Health Director Robert Zulu and Roan Antelope General Hospital Acting Medical Superintendent Chimese Mwansa. This was after the magistrate Simusamba last week summoned Dr. Zulu and Dr. Mwansa to appear before his court to explain Dr. Kambuli's COVID-19 status. Details in this report. The court sat to hear about NDC leader Chishimba Kambuili's COVID-19 status in his absence. Lusaka Principal Resident Magistrate David Simusamba heard that Kambuili first tested positive for the virus on August 16, 2020, after visiting the hospital on August 9, 2020, while complaining of shortness of breath and hypertension. Upper Belt Provincial Health Director Dr. Robert Zulu told the court that he was aware of Kambuli's COVID-19 results, even though he wasn't the one that conducted the test on him. He also said that he was aware that a second test was done, whose results came out negative. And Ron Antelope General Hospital Acting Medical Superintendent, Dr. Chimen Semwansa, told the court that she communicated the negative COVID-19 results to Kambuli on Monday, September 7, 2020, around midday. And when asked if she had evidence to show that the swab was conducted on the accused the first time on August 9th, which came out positive, Dr. Mwasa said the results were on an Excel sheet, which was on soft copying. Magistrate Simusamba then subpoenaed Tropical Diseases Research Centre Director Gesham Chongwe to appear before him and present Kambuili's initial positive laboratory results for COVID-19. In this matter, Kambuili is facing charges of forgery, altering a false document and giving false information to a public officer. The matter has been adjourned to September 15, 2020 for continuation of defense. Leandro Hamwala, ZNBC News in Osaka. Remember to hit the like button, place a comment and subscribe. Thank you so much for watching.